hello guys welcome back to my closet and welcome to my closet if you are new here i am daquana white i bring you plus size fashion content as well as lifestyle and beauty content so i don't have any housekeeping or anything like that so we're going to get right into this haul so today i'm bringing you a walmart haul it's been so many years since i've shopped at walmart for fashions um, honestly, I saw like over the years um, recently how they become more on trend. Like I used to get clothes all the time from Walmart until I started just online shopping everywhere else. <laughs> okay. But um, yeah, so sadly I won't have a coupon code or anything for you all because I just went and purchased these and this is an unsponsored haul. Um, as always, I will be completely transparent about everything, how I feel about everything, and all that good stuff. Like I said, it's been a while since I shopped at Walmart. I see they have like an Eloquii section or an Eloquii edit. I don't know, but I'm loving it, okay? So I think Eloquii goes up to, I'll put it on the screen. <laughs> I want to say 32, but I could be mistaken. But I feel like they go up to at least a 28, if I'm not mistaken. But anyways, I'll have all that on the screen. Per usual, I have everything linked down below. I'll have all the items named and um, the sizes on the screen as well. All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. So the first thing I will talk about is this top. So this top is like a t-shirt material. It's something chill. It's cute. I feel like you can do a lot with the wrap portion of it. Now you can remove, I believe, you can remove this belt here. Um, you can wrap it from the back to the front. All that good stuff. I think I just tightened it and did a bow. Like I didn't do much to it because I didn't know how I would style this shirt or wear it. Um, you can definitely wear it less cropped if you want to. But I probably would just wear it like this. It's definitely a step up from just a regular tee. It's a couple steps up. So the next so, thing I want to talk about is these pants. I knew immediately it was a cargo material, but they do have a stretch to them. I could have gotten the 24, but it wouldn't have given the baggy look that I wanted with this. It's a cargo pant. You would want it to have a little bit of room. I feel like if I would have got a 24, I would have sat down and wouldn't been able to breathe and the button would have popped. So like I said, I'm glad I got the 26 because I feel like it just fits better okay um it does have pockets it also has this belt that is attached to the pant and two clear buttons in the mid toe but yeah i like this and also it does have like a buckle on the ankle that you can tighten so then this is the back here again with the 24 it would have been way tighter on the butt it would have given wedgie vibes nobody want the wedgie vibes so yeah like how it looks back there if you are wondering i am five feet four inches and yeah these come right to the ankle so i would definitely wear these with either a heel i don't know i'm getting heel vibes what y'all think would y'all wear like a boot like a doc martin or a timlin or something like that or would y'all go for a heel i'm thinking heels all right so same top but here we have this jean now i did get this in a 24 if i would got a 26 i probably wouldn't have liked them but i do feel like the 24 is a little snug in the tummy area definitely shows off the tummy area i don't mind because most of the time i probably would have on a jacket you know or something but just in case i didn't want to have on a jacket i probably i don't know i don't know but i will say <laughs> these here are what i have been looking for as far as like boyfriend style vibes because i just haven't found it most of the ones i get they feel like flare jeans or something but this one actually gives me like boyfriend it's baggy all of that it has a slight distress in but it feels good on it's a nice denim it has a slight stretch but i will say it's definitely showing off that tummy okay but y'all it's giving booty okay i do like the back it does have a slight dip like a u but there is no gapping and it just feels snug i don't feel like it'll be any butt crack or anything like that so that is this pair of jeans i actually love them like i really really do and i'm happy that i have something like it um also i did look so i don't even have to put it on a screen i went on the site and they do go from sizes 14 to 28 i'm so proud of me i've been knocking out hauls tiktok content for my new instagram called wraps and fits it's gonna be outfits where i'm wearing headgear so hats 
um, scarves, head wraps, all that good stuff. Um, I just wanted to have a personal blog so I could have something more, what do I want to say? Something more of a hobby on social media because I have a lot of my business on social media. So I just wanted to do something like that. Okay. But anywho, <laughs> let's get into this leather dress. Now this is cute. I did get the 22. I don't know if it was because it stopped at a 22 or that was the only one left in stock. But yeah, I do like the way it fits. It doesn't look that bad. But I will say I'm scared <laughs> that these might pop open because these aren't button buttons. They are snap buttons. So, girl, I could just like at any moment and I'm just like I would definitely put in a pair of nude shorts or black shorts because I don't know. Now, this one is a little short in the back. Let's see if I can get a little more length. It's a little short. You know, this is what the back is looking like. I'm feeling like I want to do something with like a biker short underneath it does have this like poofy sleeve which i just noticed i don't know how um it's easy to look like a trash bag when you're wearing like a leather dress or a leather set or whatever that's like that has that detail but i feel like this one isn't giving trash bag vibes it's not too too shiny it's like a really nice more muted matted leather so i do like this i like that they snap because it's easier but i'm just like oh well they just pop open other than that i think this is cute and it would look really really nice with a booty or an over the knee Ooh. the angel guys was with me when i picked out this dress um but honestly i think i did really really good with the sizing so far would i have gotten a leather dress in a 24 i mean i probably would have tried it but I think I would have want a more snug fit, but I just was scared of the button, so I may sew the bottom so that it doesn't pop open, okay? But anywho, um, I got this dress in the 22 as well, so that's just like, you see what I'm doing here? I tried this in the 22 and it fits so, so perfect, like, it's perfect. And then I got the other one and it's a little more snug, but it's different material, so you just gotta play around with stuff sometimes. So anywho, this is a 22. It fits really, really nicely. These are button buttons, not snap buttons, <laughs> okay? It does have this belt, which you can take off. I think it's a cute touch, depending on what look I'm going for. Like, if I was wearing sneakers, I probably would take the belt off, um, put a fanny pack on or something like that. And if I was just wearing like heels or with any boots, I'd probably keep the belt on. It just depends. But yeah, this is super cute. Very nice thick denim. It does have stretch to it. It's not too short. I thought it would be a little too short, but it actually looks really, really nice back here. Um, safe to say, you guys will be getting a lot more Eloquii slash Walmart hauls from me. You know, sometimes when I try places that's specified or specifically for, um, dedicated to plus size women, sometimes the sizing is like, eh, all over the place. And I'm like, this is for us. Why is it like this? <laughs> Why is it like this? But this dress here, perfect. Okay, so I absolutely love, love, love this outfit. I feel like this is a really good base. Then you can go booty, heel, over the knee boot. I'm trying to think what else. Any shoe. I probably wouldn't do a sneaker because I feel like I would want this to be more of a dressed up look and not dressed down. So um, let's start with the top. This top actually comes to about right here. I have it tucked in, okay. Um, I like this. It's really lightweight. I do feel like I would wear a black bra like I have on but probably something with a little more lift because this is just like an unlined bra no pattern or lift so yeah absolutely love the cutout it's really edgy really cute but still real classy all right love this so getting into the pants now these I did get in a 24 now do I feel like a 26 would have been better? It probably would have came up higher. And it probably would have still had that snug fit. But I don't think the ankle would have been what I needed. But I don't know. I just don't know. Because who knows. I probably could have got the 26 and it probably would have fit a little better. Because I do feel like in the back it definitely dips. Okay. So this is something, like I said, this would be a base outfit. So I would definitely have a jacket on. So... Who cares about the back but i would have the jacket on or a duster or a blazer or something like that so i really don't care that the back has that little dip it's not showing butt crack or anything so i think i would still be comfortable enough to sit down and all that i can move i can maneuver 
but I do think the uh, 26 would have looked better on the behind area. So let's go ahead and get into some more jeans. And I got a duster or cardigan. Oh, this jean is giving the girls everything it was supposed to give. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. I'm over here trying to look in a viewfinder. <laughs> Anywho, um, this one is classified as a wide leg jean. So it's not like boyfriend or anything like that. But I absolutely love the length. I feel like I can go with a nice booty or a heel, even a flat and be okay. This one is giving the girls what it's supposed to give. I love the fit. I think it fits really, really nicely. Like, whew, I love these. Okay, and I absolutely love it paired with this top as well. Now, I feel like these look better in a sense than the other pair, but they're both really good pair of jeans this is what the back is looking like i feel like this was a really really classic haul like classics elements you need basics all of that like this is really really classy um i feel like it's also appropriate for all ages you know um so let's go ahead and get to that cardigan so i got this oh this feels nice what size did i get it in a 22 24 and it's like a knitted oh that feels good and that looks really good with this outfit can you see this with a nude heel or a clear heel girl this is given i had to make sure it had some pockets in there as you can see them out there but this is definitely given definitely i do feel like the sleeves are a little bit long on me but that's okay i like a chunky sleeve all right i would love this with a turtleneck I love it with this. You can have something kind of just hanging off and dangling like that. A vibe. A vibe. Um, the belt has a lot of wraparound. So we love that. This color is beautiful. Um, I definitely have to keep this around. Sometimes I don't keep cardigans. Like I'm really particular about my cardigans. But this is a good one. Love the color. So, oh, um, lastly it does have a lot of stretch to it. So, I could have gotten the, this was a 22-24, I could have gotten an 18-20. slash But that is this hair. Looks so, so good. Thank you guys so much for joining my Walmart haul featuring the Eloquie Elements. Hope you enjoyed. So again, sizes and prices would have been on the screen. Everything will be linked down below. I absolutely love this haul. This was one of my favorite hauls on the channel. This was definitely, I feel like you guys are going to love it too everything fits like really really nicely so, so yes i hope you guys enjoyed i'm pretty sure it's about four in the morning <laughs> okay i started filming pretty late today simply because i got up at five and then i went back to sleep with bae and anytime i get up and go back to sleep it's like a no okay so then i got up later then i had to feed the dogs feed myself do my makeup do head wrap and lock tutorials i just had a lot to do um, but I did was I just was like, yeah, we got to get these hauls done. So I'm going to do um, a over the knee boot haul. And I'm also going to do a denim haul and knock those out for the rest of the night. Then I'm going to go to sleep because I get to sleep in tomorrow and then I'll be filming. But I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Let me know what you think down below. Also, let me know if you want to see more of these Walmart and Eloquite edit hauls. Yes.